So I was on my way to Salt Lake City from Gallup, New Mexico to head back to work. And on my way, I ran into this guy. And right here, he is uh, passing me and cutting me off because he was mad I was that I had such a large following distance from the vehicles in front of me. Look at that. Because he didn't like that very much, so he decided to get in front of me and do that. So, easily enough, I can get away from him. No problem. And you can see here his name on his truck, John H. Kimball, 414805TF7095. This is a road raged truck driver. The entire time I was driving, well not the entire time, but uh, as I was going down the road, he was passing over the double yellow lines, passing all the other vehicles, and speeding on uh, US-6, uh, all the way going, going from, uh, all the way in, into Moab, Utah, and as we came through Moab, he was doing that to everybody. And uh, I, had, I had passed him on an upgrade, he had got stuck behind an RV, and uh, I, I passed him, and then he passed the RV over a double yellow, and then caught up to me. Uh, I was not speeding, I was going the speed limit the entire time, and he had caught up and continued to tailgate me uh, for the duration of the time he was behind me. And with the rest of the traffic that was coming down the road, he wasn't able to pass me. I was expecting him to, to go over that double yellow line and uh, come around me. Uh, there was a whole convoy of off-road vehicles coming. Uh, the police escort, I believe it was a funeral of some sort. So there was a moment where I, I did have to stop. And I did catch up to some slower traffic too where I did have to stop. And he uh, got really close to me just you know a few feet off of my bumper and then uh, when we were stopped he continued to just inch closer and closer and you can see that here in the video if you keep watching when when we stop he uh, he just continues to inch and get closer and I, I can see him in the mirror I'm, I'm holding the phone in my left hand and I've got a uh, my right hand on the wheel and my my left hand is still touching the the steering wheel to where I can still maneuver the vehicle. Um, I'm trying just to get him on video as best as I can so that I can document what uh, what he's doing and report it to his company, report it to the, the police in case there is an accident or a wreck of some sort. Um, I definitely wanted to get away from him, but there was nowhere I could go. Uh, there was, there's traffic in front of me that's going uh, the same speed that I'm going right now, and I'm just maintaining my uh, safe following distance. Unlike this guy is, you can see, that he he wants me to go faster. There's nowhere for me to go. What am I going to do? You know. So okay, well here comes the convoy, and uh, I set the phone down in my lap here, and we're pulling. I kind of pulled over to the side, and I started going again. Of course, you can see there is my, my following distance that I had, at about a six, uh, four to six second following distance. That's what I was maintaining with my car. That's what I normally do with my semi truck. It's a company rule and policy and a safe driving procedure. And he doesn't like it uh, that I'm there. So here, here's the time where he's, he's caught up to me. He's got right up behind me and he is really close. And he starts to just inch closer and closer as everybody drives by. And he'll start moving, watch his tire, watch those lugs on his tire. He's gonna do it, watch. There he is. Yep. Getting closer, slamming on his brakes, setting the brakes. And we start moving here again, kind of get away, and he catches up to me. So you can watch the rest of this and, and see. He does it the entire time until we get up into, into the city, and then he passes me on the right and cuts cuts me off, and I just get in the right lane and just go around him. 
and then he uh, he catches up to me later on in the day, all the way over to Interstate 70. Um, the whole time, you can see my following distance here. He still he still doesn't like it. He wants to go on the right. He wants to go on the left. Just, he is all kinds of mad because I have such an incredible distance for me to them. It's not that far. I'm like maybe three or four seconds from the vehicles in front of me at the speed that we're going. You can see my distance and his distance. He's he's half a car length less than that from from, from me going, uh, I don't know, I'm sure how fast we're going, 50, 55 miles an hour right here, pretty sure. Anyway, you can continue to watch this if you want. Um, thank you for watching it and uh, enjoy this road rage driving behavior. Please report it if you see it. Thank you very much. Have a good one. Look at that.